Herzlich willkommen bei Welcome to Twin Bush. There's a new Tips and Tricks episode. Today's topic: Tire Changer. Adjusting the belt tension. In the area of the motor drive, the connection to the transmission, we open the side cover. You need a size 5 Allen key. A bit of technology is built in but clearly recognizable. An electric motor, which uses a V-belt to drive a transmission with a worm drive. That means, if a wheel is being mounted, the tire builds tension, force is produced, and you notice you hear the motor running but the turntable stands still, then the belt tension is way too loose. I manipulated it a bit before. The adjustment is as follows. Loosen the adjustment screw here. The lock nut is in the back. To increase the tension, turn this nut in the back towards the front case. And then readjust this nut. This causes the motor's carrier plate to bend and it creates more tension. This means we screw a bit outwards here. And then turn bit by bit. You can clearly see how the belt gets tightened. You can leave it like this. Last but not least, tighten the nut in the back. It's all locked now and it can't get misadjusted. I have shown you the adjustment of the belt tension on the conventional design. So electric motor separately, transmission separately, on a carrier plate. There are also other versions on the X98 and specially on the current X36 WDK. There's a planetary gear installed. That means the electric motor is completely integrated into the gearbox. The advantage of this compact design, the belt tension must not be adjusted here. We can run at half the motor power with the same high torque drive for the turntable above. 